My name is Maria Karoma from Amaze TV. And, and this is Aisha Abdurazak reporting live at the annual Australian Out Waiting Place this year in our Estes. And it looks like it's a really fun time here. As you can see, we have so many Sierra Leoneans coming from all parts of the UK and even outside of the UK to be part of this event. And this is the place they come and they reunite and they meet each other and they celebrate with each other, they have a fun. We have music, we have good food and we're making friends, catching up with old friends and definitely making new friends. Stay with us, Amaze TV, as we'll be bringing you so much more. Hi, my name is Maria Karoma, and what's your name today? I'm Mrs. Elizabeth Tondone. How are you finding the program today? Ah, the program was interesting today. A lot of people turn up, so it was really amazing. Have you been coming regularly? Do you come every year, or is this your first time? Well, Estes, this is our first time, but we normally do housing every year as an organization. What's your organization? KDDA, Connor District Development Association. Okay. So do you come every year to the outing? Yes, we do, but we go to various places. Last year we were in Eastbourne and this year we are in Hastings. What was your favorite part about today's outing? Oh, well, for seeing people that I've not seen for years. That's my favorite part. And it was interesting seeing everybody going around, talking to each other. So what is your message today for people who have missed the Sierra Leone outing? Uh, my message today um, to encourage my brothers and sisters next year to participate. Okay, thank you very much. TV today. My name's Maria and what's your name? Rebecca. Nice to meet you Rebecca. So how are you finding the atmosphere today in this Sierra Leonean event? Well it is great just to see so much diversity in Hastings and it is a beautiful day and we just love to get down here and just have such a mix. It's great for us. Have you been involved in the dancing and the culture? Have you been dancing, Abba? <laughs> You've been doing a bit of dancing. Yeah, we like the music, we like the rhythm. Yeah. Have you tasted any of the food? Well, not yet, not yet. But uh, we can smell it and I think that uh, we're missing out at the moment. So are you from Hastings yourself? We live down in St. Leonard, so further down the beach. Yeah, but we just moved down here at Christmas. How are you finding the area? We like it. Yeah, Hastings and St. Leonard's has a great sense of community, like very friendly, very uh, just lots of every weekend there would be something going on and this is just one of those things so it's cool. So what do you like, which area would you say you like more? Wow, I like a bit of rock and roll right down with the old fish huts. I like the old town and, and I like St. Leonard's on sea down past the, down past the pier. Would you come again to this sort of event? Absolutely. But uh, where does everybody come from? Like, that's what we look around, like, where has everybody come from to today? Many people have come from different parts of the world. Some of us have come from London, some of us have come from America. We have different people that come from different parts of the world. Yeah, and we're all Sierra Leoneans together. So we do this every year and we come together. So, yeah. Thank you very much for your interview. Thank you. You're welcome. Have a great day. Hello again, this is Aisha Razak and with me here is this dashing young man. Um, what's your name? Raz. Raz, so is this your first time coming here today? Yeah. So what can you say about the outing? I just, I just got to say they need to produce more about music. Like They're trying but they need to do better and the food is alright. So my brother here has a message for the entertainment industry. Apparently he's saying the music is... What's your word? Oh, the music is alright, it just needs to be better. 
Yeah, so he said the music is all right, but it just needs to be better. Are you having a fun time, Mr. Raz? Yeah, 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 obviously, absolutely. <laughs> Beautiful, beautiful woman. Ati, can you tell me your name, please? My name is Annie Kaba. Annie Kaba, and what about you? Maria Mama Finder. I must say, you look so gorgeous in this dress. And this t shirt, what's it about? Well, this is our organization from the east of Sierra Leone. That is Kono. So every year we come out because it's a charity organization, you know? So when we come, we all meet together. Because sometimes it will take one year, we don't see each other. So with this organization, with the Audi, all of us come together, we meet, we make jokes, we eat, we drink, that's it. So you said this is a charity organization. Does that mean you people have um, a charity cause you're sponsoring? Um, we do some kind of a sponsors. Um, we just started, honestly, it's not been enlarge yet um, but what we mainly do we support our local people in Kwedu we provide lo the local hospital with some medications and we also do like uh, financial support for some other people if they do have some um, needs that they need financial support we also have a, a baby organization in Freetown which we launched was it last year that the organization was launched I think that was last year so basically we are the base, I would say the foundation of the Kono organization in the diaspora, we started it from the roots. So you said Kono, does that mean this organization is solely for people from Kono? No, 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 really. no, no. It's no. a descendant from Kono. Regardless, especially, let me emphasize on this, especially Kono is a metropolitan town in Sierra Leone. We have the Madingos, the Fula, the Timini, the Lim tribes. Various type of tribes. So basically, we're not saying that this organization is only for the Kono people. It's basically from, for the descendants of Kono. So regardless, whatever tribe you belong to, the Fula, the Madingo, you are welcome. We are so, all you, so you mentioned that you, you sponsor a babies. So do you mean newborn babies? Not really. Newborn baby in the sense as a new um, a baby um, organization, which is a branch from KDDA. So that one is based in Freetown. So that's the that's the first um, newborn that we have for now. We're hoping that we'll have various um, branches in Sierra Leone like Makeni, Kenema, Kabala, just for the descendants of Kono to find themselves if they're in trouble or if they're in need, they, they know where to go to seek for help. So that's what we're trying to do. So how, um, how do you send this help? Do you people go, do you plan it like end of year, you go there or you have people there that, that work with you? Yes. We have our KDDA organization in Kona. So anything that is arise in Kona, they will let us know. So we all come together. If it's a contribution, we give a little of contribution to give help to the people in Kona. So if someone watching us right now is from Kona and wants to be part of this amazing, amazing look, you guys look so beautiful having fun. Um, is there a registration fee? What must they do to be part yes, of this? They, this? they have to come and join us because we have registration fee and we, we have, have a membership fee, membership which is ten pounds a month, and then you pay I think twenty pounds for every two for every two years. No, if I can, no, twenty pounds a month, pa, no ten pounds every month for two years. Yeah, that is the contribution. Yeah, it? that's the monthly contribution. But to register, you have to pay one off payment of twenty pounds, and every two years you re-register. But the membership fee is ten pounds every month. Every month. And with that membership fee, let's say for example, when you are now a full member, something happens to you, we can come and visit you, we provide financial support, we're not hoping, praying that something happens, but whatever you're celebrating, whatever that you're crying with, we come and support you. So we are like a big family, basically. Yeah, um, I can see you. you people look so amazing, so bonding together. <laughs> part of them just um, go on Google find the website uh, what's the name of the website um, KDD, KDD.
Development Association. Yeah. Street Development Association. So if if you are from Kano, based in the UK, Sierra Leone, wherever you are and you are you are watching Amaze TV right now and you want to be part of this amazing thing they're doing, go to KDDA website and there you have a registration form. Yeah. Yes. Yes. And then you can be part of this amazing, amazing people. Look, they're having fun. <laughs> they are enjoying themselves, listening to music, having food. Oh. <laughs> oh, do I have to turn another way? So that one step forward, that is. You know one step forward, when we are dancing, we dance like this. Oh. Then we oh. jump, we go over there. <laughs> Get my dear, there's no need to fear. And then she give all your love to me My love will never disappear Lucky holder I wanna be your lucky holder Lucky holder Stay with you forever Lucky holder I wanna be your lucky holder Hi there, you're on Amaze TV And my name's Maria, what's your name? Siddiqui How are you Siddiqui, okay? Yeah, I'm fine, thank you So how are you finding the event today in Hastings? Oh yeah, it's been very good It's been a good turnout Nice to see you, you know, friendly people, happy people, enjoying themselves. It's been alright. Do you come every year? Uh, I try to. I didn't come last year, but more or less I come every year, yeah. So how would you compare this outing to previous years when you've been coming? Um, no, normally the weather isn't that great. Today's weather's been alright. It's been a good turnout. The past couple of years hasn't been that great. So I said this year's been good. It's been seen a bit more organised. Seen a bit more together and as people mingling together. It's been good. Been good this year. Would you come again next year? Oh uh, yeah, definitely. Yeah, yeah, definitely. I mean, as long as uh, what I think only that needs to happen is our generation needs to get more involved. You know, get more involved in the organisation of the event, get more people involved, other artists involved, and stuff like that. How would you go about getting more people involved? Marketing. I think I don't think the event's marketed enough. I don't think um, enough people know about it. I think it's kind of limited to people just more or less in London. You ain't got people coming out from outside London coming down to the beach. Um, and artists get other artists involved as well. Artists, like artists in the community, if you're selling tickets to get like raffles or competitions, that might market to more people. Not just Sierra Leone's, but other nationalities coming as well. So, would you like, do you know any artists that? could get involved. Me personally, no, I don't have a clue. <laughs> you don't have a clue, but then you're saying get more artists. But I like the idea though, it's a good idea. There are like there are like local Salon artists who are in the UK but you know do you make Salon your music so you connect with them or again get the Salon artists from Salon over. So yeah. So what would you say the highlight of today was? Um ooh, highlight of today it's normally just for me seeing family, seeing family, seeing love people I haven't seen in a while because I'm based in Sierra Leone. So, oh really? Yeah, yeah. So coming here and then getting to see everyone together, so I ain't got to go one by one and visit everyone works well for me. So this, no, yeah, seeing family more or less. So did you travel from Sierra Leone to come here? That'd be nice, but <laughs> no, I came from Sierra Leone for the season. Obviously it's raining over there now, so I came for the season just a little break. I'm going back in next week actually, so yeah. So how is Sierra Leone so far? How would you compare the beaches there to here? No, no you can't compare. Sierra Leone, you can't compare Sierra Leone to here. here Sierra Leone. I'm talking about like the outings, because they have outings there too. Yeah, again, I was telling my cousin earlier actually, the outings out there, because the weather's a lot nicer and like you have like a lot of family members coming all together, like not just your your mum, your dad, you got cousins, you got grandparents, you got huge family coming together, like huge members of family coming together. And it just, <laughs> and it's just a lot more it's a lot more warm, it's a lot more it's a lot more of community, it's a lot more of togetherness. And yeah, and again the weather's nicer so you got actually sand. So yeah. Yeah, I agree with you. It's much more hotter there and you know, nicer and a lot of people everyone comes together which is that's what's more about celebrating the culture and everything yeah thank you very much Sadiqi thank you all right no worries <laughs> Hello 
again, this is me, Aisha Abdul Razak with Amaze TV and... Hi everyone, uh, my name is Ibrahim. Um, Ibrahim, are you Sierra Leonean? Of course I am. Born and raised Sierra Leone. I'm in Salomo, okay, all day long, huh? So, um, can you tell us about what's going on right now here? From what I've seen, it's just coming together, Sierra Leonean people, you know, it's an annual thing where, whereby everyone comes around and then have fun, you know what I mean? We're not from this country, but we make it feel at home, like especially on a day like this, you know? Everyone come together, united as one uh, Salon people there, and then we have fun together, you know? So, whoever is to, to push uh, Mama Salon before, let's have it, huh? Alright, thank you, that was so amazing. What's your name, sir? Double A. Double A. Are you Sierra Leonean? Yes, I'm Sierra Leonean. So, what is going on here today? Um, I've seen so many people. I've seen food, music, and so many, so many faces. Everyone came here to have fun. It's Sierra Leone outing. We can't. We enjoy. It was fun. It was really nice. I enjoyed myself. A few people that I've spoken with are saying the entertainment industry has to step up. I feel we have to step up, but it was alright, it wasn't too bad. But the the organization needs to step up a little bit, but I had fun. Today was a big improvement. Alright, thank you so much. I wish you all the best. What's your name? Jennifer. What can you say about the outing today? Well, it's actually been nice, you know. It's just that the music got turned up very early. Um, so, again, we have another person that is complaining about the music. So, yeah. what do you think? I think they should get a better DJ, because this one, I think he's dead. Uh, so, you apparently think that the DJ is the one with the problem and not the music industry as a whole? No, I, I actually think it's the DJ. So yeah. what about the food? Did you, yeah, did you try the Australian jollof? Um, actually I did, yeah, it was really nice because my auntie made it. it yeah, really so, nice. so what can you tell people looking at watching you right now? Um, I'm proud to be Australian. Yes, <laughs> <Just so on. laughs> <laughs> then next year don't miss out if you're not here next year don't miss out because let me not lie this is actually late because like, Australia is actually late because Australia is the latest African country period <laughs> 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 She's so edible, sophisticated Bossy chick, man, she's so educated To make sure she's mine, uh -huh. I'm dedicated so She gives me a special lot, I'm so faded I want for taco, get sweet rose apple Snap, strike a pose, tell her they snap you What's So how are you enjoying the outing today? Um, out the outing today it was really nice, nice weather All day was cold a bit, but it was nice Will you come again next year? Oh, of course I'm coming next year, don't worry Next year I'm coming, I'm dead <laughs> what is your name? Fanta Jimmy. How have you enjoyed the outing today? Oh, the outing was so nice. I enjoyed it a lot. I had a lot of food. I met a lot of friends. All what you want. Everything about the outing is so nice. It's so perfect. What sort of food did you eat today? Perfect. I had fufu. Fufu and what? And shaba. So out of all the outings you've been going, which one is the best for you? Last year. Last year? Why is it last year? Um, I enjoy it so much because last year I have a drive to come to the beach. This year I no drive, I use the train. So how did you get here? Train. And you're taking train back? Of course, yeah. So what would you say the highlight was today? Well, as for today, everything is nice. Like, um, I can see the devil. How they call it the the aunt the aunt the how they call it the the auntie and I have fun with friends. I met a friend that have that have taken so long. I've not. So ah yes, what's wrong? What's wrong? <laughs> no. Okay, would you come again next year? Of course, I'm, I'll always be here. 
All right, thank you very much. Well, here we have the most wonderful, the most magnificent, and the man that has made this show happen here today. We have DJ Metro. You're making me blush. You're making me blush. <laughs> Am I? How are you today, DJ? Well, right now, probably just want to sleep. But I'm going to try and stay up because there's an after party. Oh really? You going to the after party as well? You're organising that as well? No, it's J1 production. J1 is organising it on behalf of the outing. So I'll be heading there. Okay, that's good. So you have to keep the energy up, yeah? I'm going to try. I'm going to try. It's going to be difficult, but fight the spirit. You can do it, you can do it. So how did you think the outing went today? I thought today was unbelievable. Even though at the beginning there was a slow start because of the music sound system, the sound wasn't correct. So I was a bit cautious because I'm, I like when I'm projecting Sierra Leone, I come with a full force. So I like everything to be on point. So the music started slowly, eventually, gradually, we got there and it was fantastic. Well, that's all right. It's a learning progress, like I say. So you eventually got there. So that's a good thing. So what would you say today? What's the main highlight of today's outing? Well, the highlight for the outing is when you see the beautiful Sierra Leoneans, come on like yourself, being here. You know, you know, when your camera crew, videoing, talking to people, interacting with the community, the most essential thing is bringing Sierra Leoneans together. And it's, I cherish this moment every year. And it's something I look forward to. So I think that's the highlight, see my beautiful, my wonderful Sierra Leoneans having a wonderful time. Entertainment is in our body. We love entertainment. I agree with you. I agree with you 100%. And I really thank you for bringing this organization together every year, coming to the outing, celebrating our culture and meeting people. People here, they meet, here they meet like old friends. And all of this happens because of you. And I want to say thank you to you. Thank you very much. Thank you very much. It's a privilege. Thank you very much. I'm a servant of Sierra Leone. So I'll continue doing that. Yeah, I think you should continue doing the good job. Thank you very much, DJ Metro. And hopefully I will see you later at the after party. Oh, it's time to do the boogie, boogie, boogie. You know, the tutu party, the dance. Oh, so, I'll be tutu party all the way. Thank you very much. Thank you very much. Wow, today's been amazing. Don't you think? It's really, really, really great because there are so many good things to, to report back to. Yeah, we saw the devil as well. The devil that everyone's been scared of. I was, I was running. <laughs> I was so scared I, I was running because for me, I think this is the, the, the first time I've seen something like that here in the UK. So yeah, I had to run. Yeah, but it's been a good turnout. I'm very happy about the turnout. And like, there's still people around, as you can see. But it's just getting a bit cold. What do you think? The, the, this weather is bipolar. We all know the UK weather. Yeah. <laughs> One minute it's hot and next minute it's not hot. It's well, it's so cold, I can't take off my jacket. And I can't take off my jacket. You can see we're all wearing our jackets. But this event was was a success and it it was so, so amazing. I would also say it was a success. It was. People saying good things about the entertainment industry, the food, the Australian love. Did you try the Australian I haven't tried nothing yet because I've been busy working. Well, um, same, same here. It's not like I've tried anything, but we can set it up from obviously the Sierra Angel office is the best because we've been. Yeah, I agree. I agree with you. Well, as you can see, today was a really, really good day. We had fun. So I would say stay tuned to Amaze TV. Stay tuned to Amaze TV for more news and entertainment. <laughs>